got a new show for y'all. Got a damn good show. I came across this video on Instagram and I looked it up on YouTube. It was this podcast uh, called Tacos and Shawarma. Shawarma? Yeah, it's a tongue twister for me. It's a tongue twister for a lot of people. Shawarma. But she was, it's this, it's this girl, right? But she's a woman. And she was uh, interviewing this trans. Yeah. And you know, when you have a, like a, a, like a woman that like, like it's a real woman, that's, and that's not, that's not woke. Mm-hmm. She's based. She's objective. She knows what a woman is. She, she looks at everything from a scientific point of view or a common sense point of view. And she interviewed a trans. Mm-hmm. So you know that interview is going to be like interesting. You got rea- intriguing. You got reality right here. Mm-hmm. And you got science fiction on it. <laughs> yeah, let's go to it. To being a trans woman, it is what it is. We're women that are transgender, and that's what we identify as. That's what we live our life as. And for the most part, men are Damn, not allowed in sororities, and I am in a sorority. And if I was a man, I wouldn't have not been initiated. So, what she make say, that make sense. <laughs> she said sorority. It's sorority, right? Is she saying sorority? <laughs> Did she say it was yes? Yeah, she said sorority. No, she said sorority. <laughs> It's, it's, you no, she, it's, I'm saying it wrong. Sorority. Sorority. Did you hear what she said? Yeah. She said, if I was a man, why did it let me into a woman's sorority? Because your school is woke. <laughs> That's why. Most schools are. Universities, they woke. Yeah. That's why they let you in there. But I ain't gonna lie. They gave you a pass. You look like a woman. I mean, I ain't gonna lie. You, you, uh, I banged a black chick look just like her. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm, I'm, trying like, to, I'm trying to think. Was that a dude? <laughs> I saw a vagina, I saw a butthole, I saw everything. I wonder if it was a Barbie pouch. No, man, you can't, you can't fake that. Yeah, she's wet too. She even squirted. it. Hey, Kevin, shut up. And hey, let's go back to the video. A sorority, and if I was a man, I wouldn't have not been initiated. So make that make sense. Bitch, you crazy as hell. <laughs> you were born a man. Born a man, I'm not a man anymore. I don't live my life as a man. No, Just because you, that's I was on born you. something does not mean that I have to be subject to that. If I feel, okay. which I did, like I'm a woman, I'm just trapped in the wrong body. This and all that. I need to. Okay, let's dive into that. Let's dive into that. Okay, so when did you decide that you want to transition into a woman? I was 13 when I knew. What did you know? Tell me. I want to. How did you know? How did you know? With my brain, with my feelings, my emotions, like the like what happened? That came to my like, head. Did you get molested? No, I did not get molested. <laughs> did something happen to you? No. So well, how did it happen? Did you fall Naturally, and hit your head? I was just born this way, and people may disagree with that, but, which I don't care. But where did you get the idea that you were like, all right, I don't want to be a man anymore. I want to be a woman. When I found the truth in me, which is that I am trans. I am born into the wrong body. I've always been. How, who I am, like my, you know, femme, this and all that, and it just progressed on. But and maybe I you're just a feminine into, man. I'm not a feminine man. If I'm, I was, I would not be a transgender. People, I'm a trans people, woman. people say that I'm a, I'm masculine all the time, but I'm still like I don't want to be a man, you know. But them, no, but really. but men, <laughs> but men are like the superior gender. So like, why would you want to switch? That don't mean nothing to me. That's not my life. I don't I'm care about their Damn. power no, I'm just, or no, I'm just the saying. masculinity or them being dumb. I don't care. I'm a woman. I don't walk around with masculine energy. But so doing how did this it start? How did it start? So you so you woke up one day at 13 and you were just like, <laughs> you woke. Up I don't want to be a boy anymore. I want to be a girl. No, how that's did it, not exactly how, how it happened. How does it work? How it happened was like just growing up, gro- getting older. You know, 13, I'm having sexual attractions. I've never been sexually attracted to a woman, never in life, never, ever, ever. So that's why I say naturally, because I'm just naturally attracted to men, going back many, 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 many. So maybe you just many, gay. No, I'm a woman. I'm not gay anymore because I'm not a man anymore. I'm I'm a trans woman, so I can't be gay. I I'm sorry. I really, I don't. You can't be gay because you're a woman now. <laughs> That's crazy, man. The way the, that perspective she has. I'm not gay anymore because I'm a, now I'm a woman. She's rationalizing. I don't want to be gay. I just say I'm trans. I'm a trans girl. Yeah, I'm not gay. I'm no, a see, woman. See, now you can live your life as a woman and this and that, but it still got to be based in reality. That's where you uh, transgenders get in trouble. Yeah, you're a trans woman. 
Yeah, you're just a trans woman. Yeah. Which is a euphemism for I'm a dude. And I hate being a dude. I hate yeah, it. I Matter of fact, it, chopped it off, and I'm a woman. You now. chopped it off? I think so. I wouldn't take it that far. How, how you going to bust? You know what, Keith? I think it's some truth to this, man. Truth to what? That they trapped in the wrong body. No, I, I, I think her brain. Yeah. Her, like gay people, like. um, They were like, different. <clears throat> like that girl asked that question. It's like, I think like, okay, what what happened to you? Something must have happened to you. Why are you like. <laughs> it's yeah. like, that's just way. That's just the straight perspective. But a lot of these po people are just born like that. They were different. Yeah. Right. When she says she trapped in. I mean, he trapped into. Oh, fuck. When he said he was trapped in the wrong body, I believe him. <laughs> because why else would a man go through this? Yeah, like you know what I'm yeah. I don't think they lie. Yeah, I don't. I don't think people choose their sexuality. Like I used to think when I was younger. Well, I never thought that. I ain't that. I was never been that stupid. But some people think gay people just say, you know what? I want to be different. I'm gonna just be date the opposite, uh, the, yeah. the the same sex. Yeah, I, don't, like, I think it's, it's like yeah, yeah. You know what, man? I'm tired of dating women. You know, I'm gonna give guys a shot. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to that glory hole I heard about. I'm gonna go suck some guys <laughs> off and see how it's like, just to try things out. Then you suck a few cocks, and you're like, man, I kind of like that. <laughs> it don't work like that. I think you're hardwired. Yeah. You know. Now some people, they might have some something in their life when they're when they're young, influence them too. Well, yeah, I'm sure. I mean, that can happen too. That's why um, I'm not going to even get into the whole pedal stuff. But when yeah. kids go through stuff like that, when they yeah. grow up, they end up being pedals. Changes too. You. It changes you because uh, first, your first uh, ejaculation <clears throat> orgasm and dude drinking off is it, it hardwires something. It changes you. Yeah. Hey, let me say something. Why are you looking at me like that? No, let me say something. No, man, you you, you think I'm a joke? Like I want to talk about this why, sexuality why you, thing. Why are you looking at me like that? Like. People think I that people hey, myself. Hey, I'm trying to say some epic shit over here. You won't let me do it. Well, say that epic shit then, man. Some people think being gay is like a choice. Like, which means if, if being gay is a choice, that means it me. It's like just like, oh man, I just I'm just I I can't do that. That's a guy. I can't do that. That's not right. I'm just gonna do the women. That's a straight guy. That's my mindset. That's not my mindset. I'm attracted to women. Don't touch me. I'm not attracted to guys. Gay people, gay guy, let's say I'm gay. So I say a gay guy, I'm like, oh man. How big is this? How big is your cock? Hey, you remember um I told you that story? Whatever. Hey, um, let's go. Uh, it's 12 let's... inches. Hey, you remember that story? <laughs> you remember... You let story. How's yours 12? Mine's only 11. <laughs> <laughs> We're supposed to be twins, man. My head's bigger. No, you just don't know how to measure. Shut up. Hey, look, remember, I was in boot camp, right? And uh, that's the first time I've been in a shower with, like, 60 dudes. It was the gayest shit ever, right? Yeah. I just kept my head down, and I looked up, and I saw this one white dude staring at all the niggas, <laughs> right? And you know niggas got big, round asses, right? <laughs> And they had soap going down the crack of that. That white boy's dick, was, I mean, that white boy's cock was hard as shit. He was just looking at everybody. And nobody noticed him but me. Dude was rock hard. And everybody was like this, man. And I was like, this man, don't y'all see this dude? Don't He's got a full erection in here. Y'all don't see this homosexual standing over here? And that dude had been in boot camp for over a year. He kept injuring himself, but they wouldn't kick him out because the dude knew like 50 languages. Yeah. He was going in intelligence. Oh. So they, get, they knew he was gay. Everybody knew he was gay. Hey, they didn't kick him out. We got some more video he, left. He's too important. Yeah. <laughs> that dude's, man, that dude's, man, that shit was crazy. Is Didn't that, nobody yeah, notice? He had a flagpole going on. Huh? Yeah, man. I still think about that, man. I can't get out of my head. You know why? Because you're gay. What? Hey, let's go to the um, last one. I mess with straight men. Straight men love me. The men straight that I fuck man? with are straight. They're not gay or bisexual. So, so none on. of that. But there are men that are gay and bisexual, but I don't okay. Not my type. Okay, no. stop, stop, stop. I have a lot of questions. <laughs> I have a lot of questions. Okay. 
So you were gay. You laughed like a woman. At one point in time, before you, I transitioned. Like before a black you transitioned, woman. you were gay. <laughs> I was. And then where, from gay, how did it go to, you know what, I'm being not gay. Trans, any, ex, explain it to me. Being trans, being a woman, you're, becoming a woman, growing into my mother. Explain it to me, though. I'm trying to understand. Okay. You're gay. You're a woman. I was. I'm not gay anymore. I was. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, hold on. Isn't trans part of the gay community? No, trans are part of the LGBTQIA plus community. Is, is that, that not branches? the gay? Is that not is the gay community? Each of those letters <laughs> mean different. Get up, but are you all gay? <laughs> no, we're not all gay. That's true. That's no. true. They're not all gay. Not all transgenders are gay. Yeah, because like a lot uh, of people, men that want to be a woman, they be they be in a relationship with a woman. Wait a minute, this shit always confuses me. No, like Caitlyn Jenner. Shut up. A He's woman a lesbian that, now. A woman that wants to be a guy. Wait a minute. Hey, Kevin, just shut up. No. You be, how many transgender couples have you seen where the male wants to be a woman and the woman wants to be the guy? Yeah. And they still have them straight sex, but they're, they're not gay, they're just transgender. Yeah. Yeah. I like, didn't know that, man. Like Caitlyn Jenner, when he, um, when he did his little transition, I said, oh, this dude wants to get packed. Nope. He wants to get done. He wants to get done like a woman. He wants. He want. On. He want to. He want to be on his back with his high heels on, and a dude just driving at home, just plowing. Nah, he's a lesbian. Yeah. See, not all transgenders are the same. All right. They're a very diverse group of people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they are. That's what you call diversity. <laughs> <laughs> I can um. Like she said, she doesn't date. Well, he. She wants an alpha male. She don't want no no feminine sissy. She wants a man. She wants a real man. She wants to be the woman. She wants to get packed. Yeah, she wants an alpha male. He man to come in and pack her, blow her back out. <laughs> he don't know feminine pussy dude coming out. I'm, uh, bi I'm bisexual. <laughs> oh, you like she the, wants a real man. Uh, you like my hair? Uh. <laughs> Oh, man, this is crazy as hell. It was a great I believe him, man. He, he is a woman trapped in a <laughs> wrong body, man. I mean, how else would you explain him putting in all this work? Hey, yeah, yeah, pull him back up and kill the sound. Look at his edges. His that's, edges that's, is on that's fleek. Like, that's like a black culture thing. Yeah. Only black girls do it. You see, white people, I'm going to educate you on, on black culture. You see her forehead, see all that hair laying down? <laughs> that's called edges. <laughs> That's the only they popular take some grease or in jail. the black community. They take grease or jail, put it back up. Yeah, they call them edges. And it gets plastered down to the forehead. Yes, yeah, edges. You will never see a white chick doing that. Like, if you daughter. do see a white chick doing that, I suggest you do an about face <laughs> and run as fast <laughs> as you can. Because like that white girl is none but trouble. Hey, um, like my daughter, she, she, she brought me up on, up on edges. I said, Dana... That shit looks stupid. <laughs> if you ever come in my house again with them damn edges on your forehead, <laughs> it looks, we gonna have a problem in here. It looks tacky, man. Yeah. You know, man, me and Keith been whitewashed as a, as a, as culturally from our from our culture. You know, like growing up. That's not whitewashed. I just think it looks dumb. No, I want. I'm, I'm talking about something else. Like. How many? I mean, sometimes it looks I good. Better no, no, let me let me clean this up. Bring him back up. Bring him back up. See, edges is fine, but damn, that's too many. Edges. That's what is you doing? That's like edges everywhere. He's got some good hair though. Are you kidding? Is that a wig? That's just too much edges. You don't need to do all that. I guess I'm talking to myself again. Hey man, like see, white women don't see the white women. It. See, white women don't do that. Go back to the black chick. I mean, dude. Crazy. I just don't like it. That's a, it's a cultural. It's a cultural. That's, that's, that's a cultural thing. Hey, you know what? The tits is looking nice. I ain't gonna lie. Man. The skin is flawless. He, he got some nice skin. I wonder how he got it so smooth like that. <laughs> <laughs> Put it up at that nigga's skin like carnation milk. <laughs> man, shut up, man. Yeah, he ain't got a blemish on it like he's airbrushed. Well, maybe he's a is a dude trapped in a woman's body. Well, he's taking hormones, the skin. Um, oh yes, yeah, what they do? Because he Pop said he's you. taking um, the hormones. Yeah, like uh, women glow, like niggas. We be getting scars and skin all dry and shit. Well, that niggas glowing. Razor bumps and shit. <laughs> that skin. Uh, that niggas glowing. Look at him. 
That nigga's glowing. Look. He even hold his head and neck like a woman. He, he like, she, he, he like, you know what? what? That expression on her face is like, oh my God, he's got a big one. <laughs> That's not going to fit inside of me. <laughs> hey man, what are we talking about? I don't know. We talking about trainees. Where the transgender community loses a lot of people is when <clears throat> you, okay, it's fine that you're a, a man living your life as a woman, but you're still a man. You, y'all, everything has to stay based on facts. That's yeah. where you lose people. Yeah. People think you're crazy. And then you try to justify by going down this road that's not objective. It just makes you look crazy. Yeah. Yeah. What we try to say is, you didn't transition. Your wardrobe transitioned. And them edges. Yeah. Yeah. But you're still a guy, but you're, you're, a, you're, actually, woman. You're, you're actually a gay guy living this life as a woman, which means you're a transgender woman. Yeah. That's what you are. You're still gay. Yeah. Does your dude. Fuck it. That's a damn good show. I don't know what else to tell you. That shit's over. Hey, got a new giveaway going. F-250. 10,000 in cash to enter the win. Go to officialhawkstwins.com. Anything you buy on the site gets you automatically. Enter the win. Yeah.